Hello business people and business students. So welcome to the lesson 10 of our MS Excel tutorial series. So in this lesson, we will discuss how to manage a worksheet. So let's go. So before we will start, Please click the subscribe button and notification bell para updated kayo sa mga video natin. So post the video first and download the file. Uh, the file name is uh, Managing Worksheet. Yeah. So the file link is nasa baba ng video ito, nasa description. Okay, so what we will do now is... Um, Nagawa tayo ng quarterly um, report, no? So, we will separate this one ito, uh, first quarter, no? Yung second quarter, third quarter, and fourth quarter, no? Dito. So, we will add a sheet for first quarter and third and fourth quarter. Okay, so, to do that, no, we will copy, no? this um, worksheet no? so first copy the, the worksheet so how to copy the worksheet is uh, right click okay then click the move or copy okay move or copy then click move to end then create copy check this one no? create copy then click ok Okay, so this is for the first quarter. No, we will edit na lang mamaya no yung uh, the first quarter. Then do the same no for the second to fourth quarter no. So move or copy to end and create copy. Okay. And another one for the fourth quarter okay so that's how you copy and uh, copy the worksheet okay you can also copy the the worksheet to another workbook okay okay to do that uh, let's you know, let's create a new workbook okay so let's save this workbook uh, to a folder so any folder you want no? so let us name this workbook as copy no? copy or whatever I know um, file name na gusto mo ok then save ok then go to your to the in previous workbook natin yung mayroong file no then uh, for example we copy natin yung monthly uh, monthly expense no ito so right click no same sa ginawa natin kanina then click move or copy then instead na managing ano worksheet na work to book ano workbook select natin yung ginawa natin na workbook kanina which is yung copy that xlsx no then move to end then create copy then click ok ok so mapansin nyo na nandito na yung uh, ano natin yung kinop yung kinopia natin na worksheet na dito sa copy na um, workbook ok that's, that's how you copy a worksheet or another workbook okay let's go back to our main ano um, file this is the managing worksheet okay so let us edit this one no para magiging quarter na siya no first quarter so let us delete no I delete natin itong um, april to december okay so delete no right click then delete then highlights natin then delete Okay, so it, yung total niya mag-automatic siya, no? So, change natin yung ano niya, 
uh, file uh, yung ano niya yung title ng ano report okay so first quarter first quarter expense expenses okay ayan so so i-rename din natin yung kanyang um, name ng worksheet so to rename the worksheet ano name so right click then rename okay then uh, type natin first quarter or first Q first quarter expense okay then uh, press enter okay then do that no do the same sa mga next worksheet natin for second quarter so second quarter ang i-delete natin yung March no until March then ito so July until December then delete okay then rename the worksheet no second quarter expense okay enter then sa third quarter natin so yung third quarter is from July to uh, September okay so delete so delete mo yung October to December so rename the third quarter expense then lastly fourth quarter natin okay until September delete rename yung fourth quarter na expense okay okay so kalimutan natin ano um, i-edit ito no? so second quarter Okay. Then third quarter. Then fourth quarter. Okay. So just like a filing cabinet, so para ma-distinguish natin yung mga quarters natin, we can add colors no, sa mga uh, worksheet natin tab, no, sa mga tabs natin sa worksheet. Okay? So, to add color, um, okay, right click, then, tab colors. Okay? So, sa first quarter, as color it blue. Okay? Sa second quarter, um, orange sa so, third quarter green and sa so, fourth quarter red no? ok so color coded na yung um, ano natin no? um, per quarter na mga reports no? so organized na siya so you can also add another worksheet no to add another worksheet just click this plus sign here no new sheet okay then the new worksheet is lalabas siya dito no next to the first ano natin uh, worksheet okay so continue sheet 5 yung kanyang ano because this is the fifth no worksheet na nilagay natin okay so you can also reposition this worksheet no doon sa last or kung saan mo siya gusto to reposition the worksheet just drag no the worksheet no kung saan mo siya gustong ilagay drag mo lang no click mo siya then i-drag mo siya papunta doon sa uh, 
place na gusto mo siyang i, i locate, ilagay no relocate okay noon okay then you can also hide no this worksheet no so to hide this worksheet click then hide the worksheet okay then to unhide just click wherever you want no dito then unhide okay so papipidin ko kayo dyan kung ano yung unhide ninyo no okay then click okay so dyan siya okay and to delete a worksheet no so same right click then delete worksheet okay okay so next one is the use of freeze paints no? so dito mapansin nyo dito na pag i lagay natin yung cursor doon sa pinakadulo no sa total so hindi natin makikita yung an kung anong pangalan ng expense na ito no yung account name niya okay so para uh, mag-retain no yung account name dito so we will use phrase paints okay so i phrase natin tong uh, area na ito no pupunta di pag pupunta tayo dito okay so to do that um, lagay mo yung cursor dito na part kasi dito mag freeze no, na area ok then go to view ok then sa window na no na group no may freeze paints dyan click mo then click mo yung freeze paints ok so meron siyang ano dito parang border no so pag i-move natin yung cursor so hindi siya hindi nagagalo ito na part no niyan okay pati rin yung bonds niya kung magdagdag ka ng expenses okay so last thing is uh, shortcut key no uh, to go to another um, worksheet no para di kayo mag, di na kayo mag-click ng mouse gamit ng mouse kayo dito no so the shortcut key is um, control uh, page down and page up okay so control page up ay page down kung pupunta ka sa sa right na no? from left to right ganyan and control page up no from right to left okay so yun yung ano niya shortcut key Noon. So, di, di ka nagagamit ng mouse. So, mas efficient yung ano mo paggamit ng Excel pag gagamit ka ng mga shortcut keys. Okay, so that's all for this lesson guys. And don't forget to click na no, subscribe button and notification bell para updated kayo sa mga latest ano, tutorial video natin. Have a good day!